holiday party season is here, and who better to look to than the celebrities for festive fashion? And here to help you get sexy for that swanky soiree. You like that? Yes. Sexy, sexy. for that <laughs> swanky soiree. <laughs> it's CocoBab.com beauty editor Tasha Turner. Tasha, so good to Hi, see how you. Are you? How are you? Welcome. Thanks for well, you're me. already looking sexy yes. for the swanky thank soiree. You, thank you. Always <laughs> trying to be. Trying to be. So why is our society so obsessed with celebrities, first of all? Because we do look to them for style inspiration. Mm -hmm. Well, I think in our age of infotainment, infotainment. It, like celebrity is all over the place. There's nowhere you can turn without seeing celebrities. Social media, you see it on TV, on your magazine. She's all over the place. He's all over the place. So there's no way, nowhere you can turn nowadays without seeing celebrities. So and reality shows, that's mm -hmm. another thing. And we see them, they're always done up. They're perfect. Mm -hmm. So who does not want to look to their best girlfriend in our head that we think <laughs> is our celebrity and say, I want to be that. I want my curl to be there. Exactly. So I want those lashes. Right. Yeah, I want that no bag. no way we can get away from her mm -hmm. at all. Point, so point. today we're going to be focusing on hair and makeup. So which one of your celebrity best friends in your head <laughs> always gets it right on the red carpet? <laughs> Beyonce gets it right she all does. the time on she the does. red carpet. Mm -hmm. you, you, you see that dress on her and her hair is perfect. Her mm -hmm. makeup is perfect. It's, it, it, she's feeling vamp and she has a red lip or she is feeling subdued and she is giving us a completely nude look, but it's always right. It's always perfect. You see her hair is straight, mm -hmm. her hair is curly. There's no way, there's no way that you look long. at her <laughs> and say, oh, not today, Beyonce. Mm -hmm. None of us ever say that Every about day. Her. She could be wearing a bag on her head every day. <laughs> oh, okay. Perfect. Shannon, we get it. Sorry. <laughs> I Girl. also think, <laughs> <laughs> who else do you think is knocking it out of the style park? I think newbie, um, Lapita. <gasps> Lapita yeah. Nyong'o. Yes, Love I just think slave. 12 years a slave. Yes. I am so proud of her. I look at her on the red carpet and whether she's wearing bright makeup or she's nude, it's always just beautiful. Mm -hmm. She gracefully walks that red carpet. And she wears color so well. She does wear it so well. And She'll have a blue eyeshadow on, a red lip, or she will go completely nude, and still, she is so graceful on that red carpet. It's so true. I Very love it. regal. Well, we're yes. going to get to her look in a little bit, but let's start off with hair, because we want to talk about, I think you have Alicia Keys. You say her do is just the die for. <laughs> it is. You know, I'm so happy that someone is wearing a short cut. And no one is, you know, in the wintertime, we think we don't have to go short in the winter, we're going to go long, but I think for Alicia Keys, she has taken her shortcut and she's a rock star with it. We saw her mm -hmm. transformation. She started off with a short bob and then she went completely short. And now she pumps the top, she yeah. lets it go crazy and sexy, she brings it down, she may have puts a little curl in it. And you so, have a model here that has done the same style. Yes. How did yes, you achieve yes. this? It looks just like Alicia's. What we've done was, we really just made it a rock star edge. We added some pomp to the top mm -hmm. and we pulled back the side. So even if you don't have a short cut or you may have a short bob there, you can still create the illusion of a short cut. Mm -hmm. Pull back those sides, really pomp that top and add some volume there. And it just looks gorgeous. So if you want to go out a um, night with the girls, if you were doing something at work, looks amazing. Very rock star. Yeah. I like work it. it. Mm -hmm. Work it. <laughs> Yeah, that's we very, love it. very nice. Yes. And that, that, that's what, hairspray, some holding spray, maybe some like That is a few curls, curls, some bobby pins, oh. and some hold spray. So oh, okay. that top is just, it's hell to the gods. To yes, it's teased to the gods. Okay. But a lot of the curls that you put in, when you put curls into your, your hair, you're instantly adding some volume without teasing. Okay. And I know if you're a black woman, you don't, you're not really used to teasing, so you don't have to do it. And you don't want frizz. So right. you wouldn't necessarily tease, but you would add some curl and maybe you use a smaller curling barrel than you would your your your, your usual. That's a okay. very, and that adds the volume. Very good point. Now yes. one of the other style divas who always gets it right is Kelly Rowland, isn't she? Oh Kelly Rowland. Mm -hmm. yes. Don't I it's, see her transformation. <laughs> I tuned just into from X young Factor girl just to watch her and to see what she's going to be wearing. Is great. Mm -hmm. the, and you know I think what she does right all the time is that top knot. <gasps> yes. Mm. She will work that top knot coming from the gym <laughs> or she will. <laughs> ride the red carpet and wear the top knot. Sometimes she has that bang and sometimes she just brings it straight back. That's and I, I think, what a simple style. Well, how do you achieve it? You said simple. 
It's, it's really, um, you need a hair elastic, you pull your hair back, we have a boar bristle brush, you uh -huh. may use some pomade depending on the texture of your hair. So a little pomade, you brush the hair back, and then you wrap your hair around the, the uh, hair elastic, and, and then you pin it with bobby pins. Now, if you don't have a long lock going down your back, can you add some yeah. assistance you can up there? definitely <laughs> yeah. add some assistance. Um, and you know, I think the girl nowadays loves some assistance. Yeah, I was trying yeah. to make sure I said it the All appropriate way. <laughs> All of us has that, that piece of hair in our bag, yeah. just in case we need it. And you, you roll it right in with your ponytail, you roll it around your ponytail, and you pin it right in. And okay. it's as simple as that. And even if you don't have assistance and you have a little bit there, that's when you want to tease. Mm. That's when you can tease that hair till the end. you don't want a stingy little and knot. Just no, you right don't there. want a <laughs> like, no really stingy it. knot, but you can fake you a knot. Full knot. Right. Right. Fake, fake a full knot okay. with, yeah. with a bit of tease there. Okay, oh. well, the next step we have is Odie Buck Goody and Sierra is always rocking it, right? I think Sierra has taken that Oldie Buck Goody, that bob, and has brought it up notches. She sure has, because the bob has been around for a while, but people keep reinterpreting it, and it looks great on Sierra. It works for everyone. Mm -hmm. It's for that mid-length hair, it's for that short bob, mm -hmm. you can have long hair, and you can always work that bob. You know, it's for that working mom, mm -hmm. it's for us who's just career girls. If you're going to school, you can always wear a bob and be safe with it. And your model is rocking it today. How did you achieve this? We added a, we kicked it up a little a notch here, but mm -hmm. we added some wave to it. We added a little a bit of curl. Bob. This is her party bob. Mm -hmm. And she had a little color at the ends of her hair. So oh. I thought that that would be amazing. And if you have color, it's okay. You don't have to wear your church girl bob like I have. We have, we're dark uh -huh. hair. Sometimes uh -huh. it gets boring, but you know, we're busy. So if you're younger and you can work it a bit, add a bit of color to it. Add some low lights to the end of that and okay. add some wave to it. That's that way it creates idea. fun. It, it, you can go to your holiday party and just look so fun. Now, again, with great. this one, is teasing key? Teasing is not key here. No, rolling? What we did here, <laughs> what we did here was we rolled the hair, we used a curl and iron, a large barrel curl and iron all around the hair, okay. and then what we did was we just let it fall. Oh. So it fell to this, and then her hair was a little long and we wanted to bring it up just to have that fun and just to add some wow factor. And we created a faux bob here, and we just rolled it up a bit and did, and did some pins. All right. And that was it. Mm -hmm. She looks good. All right, good girl. Party time. Looks great, right? Break you like the Prosecco. <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk about makeup. Yep. Jennifer Hudson, she always gets it right on the red carpet. She does get it right on but the red carpet. But she has a great base, the flawless skin. She helps. always wears flawless skin. Mm -hmm. And in the past, she's always worn nude makeup. She's just gone. It looks great. It looks flawless. But what I've seen she's done, like it, it, at the AMAs, she... She whipped out a blue eyeliner on us. Oh. She popped it with some color. And, and now she you took that look and really popped it. And that's what we did on her. So you want to take your bob up a notch with some mm -hmm. color in any look that you have. You should take it up with some color. You add a, just a bit of a line. If you're going to do color, I would suggest that you only do it on top. OK. Oh. Small line with an um, eyeliner brush and just pull it out like she's doing there and pull it out maybe a little bit out of the corner of the eye. Okay. So that gives oh. you the cat eye. Gives you the cat eye. And, you know, channels a 1960s just look. Just a little it bit. Doesn't, not the whole eye. Not the eye. whole eye because okay. you don't want to create a heavy blue eye. You don't want to look like that woman. You no. don't right. want to no. be that woman. <laughs> and you so. do run the risk of looking too 80s if it's yes. not handled yes. correctly. Yes, So you want to yeah. thin... So eyeliner there. You can get it with a liquid liner or you can get it with some gel liner and it's just simply pulling your liner brush right on top of the eye and pulling it out just okay. a little bit. All right. Yes. Good job. Now what about Nicole Richie? You said something about her eyes you like as well, right? Nicole Richie, what I she always does is she wears those lashes oh, to the sure end does. and there's no way <laughs> Um, in this day and age, particularly the ones who's giving selfies and you're on social media, lashes will always look like you are done even when you're not done. And I think that's a great secret that Nicole Richie always has. Okay, so, but I have to ask, with the lashes, I see some women who have lashes and they look so heavy like they're batting. Yeah. <laughs> How do you know the perfect length of the lash that's you're supposed true. to put on? What you want to do is you want to get a natural hair lash. So most of the times you see celebrities on the red carpet. You see J-Lo, you'll see Oprah, and they're wearing mink lashes. Mm -hmm. Now, 
The regular girl cannot get mink lashes. No. So what she wants it's to expensive. do when she goes into the store, she wants human hair lashes. Oh. They're softer. They look much. They look so natural, mm -hmm. and they don't wear as heavy. So you're not ruining your here? lashes. That... So what you can do is a short hair natural lash. You get. You put a little bit of that glue on there, mm -hmm. as she's doing here. You let it dry just a little bit, so it can get a little sticky, and then you pop it right on. She's just putting it right over her normal. You put lash. it right on your normal lash. <laughs> do not think too hard about it, or you Shannon, won't do it. I'm Shannon like all into just, it, like wow. Shannon's so confused. He's like watching <laughs> oh, a it's, science it's experiment. It's such a girl. But wait, thing. It's what, such will a you girl pull thing. off your own lashes when you take it off? No, because no. it's above, right above. Yeah, it's the right hair above. Oh, that I pulled lash. the wrong thing. Look. And that's also <laughs> the good point that you're making, though, because you would think that you're going to rip your lash off. That's why we recommend getting human hair lashes. They're not as heavy on your eyes, so you're not ripping out your lashes. That's true. Now, this is something that I don't recommend you do every day, but mm -hmm. holiday season and it's New Year's Eve, yeah. you so you have to kick get it lashes. Okay. You look so dumb when it's, it's, the va -va when it's on. It's the va-va-boom. Yes. Va -va and look how, look how amazing Ooh. that looks. Yeah. And she, she has Look at those eyes. She right. doesn't have <laughs> mascara on there. She doesn't have an eyeliner on there. She okay. is just giving lash. And look how sexy that looks. Wow. Okay. That's an eye party. I mm. like it. Oh, we love an eye party. We love an eye yes. party, right? All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we mentioned Lapita earlier. Yes. She has amazing lips. And she's not afraid, again, to play with color or to experiment she's with a nude lip, an orange lip, a bright red lip. Not afraid to give us that nude lip. Mm -hmm. And I think, you know, particularly with women of color, that nude lip, we get it confused. We want to usually just put a bit of Vaseline on it and, and run out the door. Yeah, but that's but not it. <laughs> yeah. That trick, that rule is, is that we, it's an intentional nude. You uh -huh. know, it's our secret, it's an intentional nude. So what we always do is we put a little color on that lip first. We put a little lipstick on that color, uh -huh. on that lip first. And Very it could sneaky, be the no, <laughs> same color. It's the tricks that we use from the trade. It's the same color of the lip. Now, you have to look at the undertone of what your lip is. And if that bottom lip has a little pink in it or if it has a little brown in it, that's what you want to pull out. You put that color on first to base it as Miyako is doing, and then she'll put a little bit of gloss on it to, to add that shine. Huh. Now, what happens is you have that intentional nude there, but with the lip gloss, with the lipstick, it does not run off so fast. So you know when you put on lip gloss and you're like, what happened? I just thought I had on my lipstick. It's so like, true. It, it's not there anymore. Yes. It will, the staying power when you put on lipstick first and then a gloss is amazing. You'll, you'll notice that an hour and two hours later, it's that color is still on there. And that's oh. what's important about the nude. You still want that color. But the thing about the nude lip that's important mm -hmm. is that it allows you to play up everything else. So you can do the smoky eye yes. and the prominent cheek yes. as yes. long as the lip is contained. And then Lupita has short hair. Mm -hmm. I mean, her hair is, is basically, she's cropped. So mm -hmm. what better way than to show her features and to show her full lips and to show those amazing eyes is to go nude and really say, look, I'm out here. That's someone who is comfortable with her look yeah. and she okay. loves herself. Well, she as we bring look. all the ladies back out so we can see these fabulous looks again, I want to ask you, regardless of what style you're going with, what's one important tip that people should remember when doing their hair and makeup? I, I need people to know that when you're recreating a look, particularly when you are wanting, you're looking at a celebrity and saying, mm -hmm. oh, I want to look like that. Oh, I want mm -hmm. that. You have to know you won't look like that, per se. <laughs> Get the idea of what you're trying to recreate mm -hmm. and go with that. If it's curls, then go with the curl that works best for you. If it's popping your lip, then go with the red or whatever color that works best for you. Yeah. So that way you are not saying, when you look at the picture again, didn't work that way. Right. You, have to, you have to go with what works All for right. you. Well, for more looks, we'll make sure we go to CocoFab.com and check you out. Yes. Yes. Thank, Thank you so you much. Thank you so much for having <laughs> Happy me. Happy holidays. Oh, happy holidays to you. And you're watching Arise Entertainment 360.